are those boys? Hi. Hi. Oh, thank you. Hi. Can I see the little baby? everybody welcome to today's vlogmas episode um that clip that you guys just saw <laughs> so cows are one of my favorite animals cows um and we live in texas so there's a lot of ranches out here that raise the cattle for eating them anyway um so i told matt that if we drive by one of these places out in our um, neighborhood area and the cows are by the fence, like, I wanna go and talk to them. <laughs> so Matt was just driving and then he just, he stopped all of a sudden and I saw him and I freaked out, like, I freaked out a little bit. Um, of course they didn't want me to pet them, but that's okay. They're awesome, the cows are so awesome. They're just like, so gentle and cool, like chill, laid back, kinda like Matt, you know? Just like cool with whatever. They just eat and stare. Yeah, that's, hey, that is like me. <laughs> that really is, it's like that. Um, anyway, so, today, what are we gonna talk about? Mm, feelings, right? Feelings, yes. What are we gonna talk about? So, um, I talk about this all the time. I have anxiety, um, and a lot of the time, what comes along with anxiety is um, somewhat depression. They kind of go hand in hand. Um, I've never been much of a, a depressed person, but I go through this. Um, and I woke up this morning and it's just one of those days where I'm just feeling down. Like there's no particular reason. I'm just feeling kind of down. And then being uh, stressed adds to it. So I wanted to know his thoughts on um, how to kind of work through that. Do you have any tips? Well, it's tough coming from me, mainly because I am really just laid back. So I don't really have a lot of ups and downs. It's really just kind of like a spike every once in a while, and I don't really get negative. So, like, no downs, really, with me. Basically, he's, like, attitude goals. <laughs> That's what you are. Yeah. Um, I guess I could talk about what helps me. Yeah. What helps me is this guy having a support system. And whether that's your spouse, whether it's a friend, uh, parent, sibling, whoever. Having a support system and just being able to tell somebody, hey, I feel down today. I don't expect him to do anything to make me feel better immediately, but just sometimes just telling somebody can make a big difference for me. And that um, kind of goes the same with anxiety. I don't like to talk about being anxious but it does help to have somebody know. Um, so just telling him and then just having somebody be there, even if it's just sitting together in silence, but having somebody be there for you and with you, knowing that you're not alone, whether it's being anxious or being down. Um, so that's something that helps me and then distractions. So. I was getting ready and just kind of sitting alone with my thoughts and then we left and I saw the cows and the cows make me feel better. Make it makes me feel better. The cows makes me feel better. The cows make me, helped make me feel a little bit better. Um, now we're gonna go and I have a bridal shower to go to for my future sister-in-law and spend some time with family and then we're gonna go climbing so I know that things are gonna get so much better after this but yeah just not sitting alone and dwelling on it is a big thing for me because I tend to do that. I tend to want to dwell in my sadness or anxiety. Um, and I think that's a reoccurring thing for people that struggle with it is it, it 
forces you to isolate yourself, but can't do that. Can't do it. So we're gonna go make this day better. Take it all one step at a time. Cause that's really how you need to do it. One thing at a time. That's true. I talked about this Friday. Um, I in a couple couple vlogs ago when I was talking about being really anxious whenever we had so much to do for the party. And I told myself and I told you guys, take it one task at a time. And at the time my task was to work out and I got that done. And so one thing at a time. Right now my one focus is to go and get a present for the bridal shower and maybe coffee. And then the next task will be to go and enjoy it. Yeah, so that's that. I hope that this maybe helps encourage somebody today that watches this video. I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope your holiday season is going well. And yeah, go give a cow a hug today. <laughs> don't don't put yourself in danger, please. Yeah, yeah. Um, they're not all the most friendly. I don't know. They're big. They're big creatures. They could crush you. They could easily crush you. Um, but really, if you happen to see a cow, appreciate how awesome they are. Freaking love cows. All right. Um, I'm not sure if that's gonna be the end of this vlog. If it is, thank you for watching. If not, we will see you guys in the next clip. Anybody help me? <laughs> what are you looking at, Agent? Oh, oh, oh my. What? Is it the roller coaster? The roller coaster yeah. One. Did you look up at the, the blimp? Look up. Yeah, if you look around. Because I know there's a blimp that goes over the top of it, too. Oh, no. No, no, no. <laughs> Most of the ones I have, though, are like. What's happening? Oh, there's a. Oh, oh, oh. What happened? Oh. Whoa! Hey, those are cars. What are they going? Oh, it looks real. Do you look up at the sky? Oh, 